Hi, and welcome back to the PDF Element channel. My name is George. In today's video, I'm gonna share with you a couple of tips on how to share your PDFs between your Mac and your PC, as well as sharing it with pretty much anyone else in just a few seconds. In this way, you'll be able to make the most out of all the tools offered by both of these systems without compromising on your file transfers. Welcome back to the PDF Element channel. So, Mac and Windows are both fantastic operating systems. Both have their unique advantages and disadvantages. And if it weren't for how slow and tricky it is to transfer files between these two operating systems, these could easily be much more complementary tools. Fortunately, this problem has a solution. In this video, I'm going to show you how to solve this problem using PDF Element. In this way, you'll be able to share your PDFs between Mac and PC with ease. And we'll be going over these steps. Opening a PDF file on Mac, uploading Mac files to the cloud, opening your Mac PDFs on your PC, sharing a PDF from PC to Mac and sharing PDFs with other people. Before we get in any further, make sure you've got PDF Element downloaded. If you haven't got it downloaded yet, go check out the link in the description below to get your free download. Number one, open a file on Mac. To get started, you'll need to open your PDF using PDF Element. This is very simple. Just right click on your document and display the open with submenu and choose the Wondershare PDF Element option. Great, you've opened your document with PDF Element. Now I'll show you how to use the application to share your PDFs between your Mac and your PC. Number two, uploading Mac files to the cloud. To start sharing your documents, first you're gonna to have to upload them to the Wondershare document cloud. But don't worry, this is very simple. All you have to do is display the file menu on the application, display the share submenu, and click on the document cloud option here. If you haven't logged into your PDF Element app yet, you will see a login pop-up where you'll need to enter your Wondershare ID and click next. If you don't have a Wondershare ID yet, simply use the sign up link to create one. Once you have entered your Wondershare ID, you will need to enter your password and click login. Now, you just have to wait for your document to finish uploading to Document Cloud. When it's ready, you'll be able to view and access it from the Document Cloud section of the app. Cool, now your documents are already in the cloud. And as long as your documents are in the cloud, you can access them with your Wondershare ID. If you've just purchased the new iPhone 14, you probably want to use your phone as another work tool. If that's the case and you're wondering how to share your files from your Mac to your iPhone, then you need to know that using PDF Element offers you plenty of storage above what you already get with iCloud. Because PDF Element has a fully compatible iOS version that works with iPhone 14 and iOS 16. That's not the key point of this video, but if you want to learn how to do this, just search how to sync PDF across devices on our channel and you'll find the video that does just that. Now I'm going to show you how to open the previously uploaded files from the PC. Number three, opening your Mac PDFs on your PC. Fantastic, we're almost done. Now all you have to do is open PDF element on your PC and sign into your Wondershare ID to view the files that you recently uploaded from your Mac. Let's have a look at this process now. First, open PDF element for Windows and then go to the document cloud section. Now click on login, then enter your Wondershare ID and password. Once you've logged in, you'll be able to view and access all documents you've previously uploaded to the cloud. To open a file, all you have to do is go to the document cloud section and double click on the document you want to open. Or you can click on the button with three dots and click on open. And that's it. Sharing a document from your Mac to your PC was very easy, wasn't it? Now I'll show you how to share a document from your PC to your Mac. Number four, sharing a PDF from your PC to your Mac. Sharing a PDF file from your PC to your Mac is very similar. First, we're gonna to need to return to the document cloud section. But this time we'll click on the cloud button that is located in the upper right corner of the window. Use the Windows File Explorer to set the source path of the file you want to transfer to your Mac. Once you've done this, a pop-up window will appear where you will need to assign the name under which you want to save your document in the cloud. Once you're ready, click on Upload. Now, just wait a few seconds for your document to be uploaded to the cloud. Then, on your Mac, open the PDF Element application and go to the Document Cloud section. You'll immediately notice the document you uploaded from your PC is now accessible from your Mac. To open it, all you have to do is left click on the document name. And voila, you finally shared your PDF files between your Mac and your PC. But wait, before I go, I have one more tip to share with you. Number five, sharing these PDFs with other people. This last tip for today is gonna to be how to share your PDFs with anyone else, even if they don't have PDF element yet. First, we're gonna open that document again in Document Cloud. With our document open, you can click on the share button located in the top right corner of the window and click on the copy link button that appears in the pop-up window. Perfect, now all we have to do is send this link to whomever you want to share your document with. When we do this on Mac, the process is even easier. All you have to do is click on this button with the three dots and click the option, create shareable links. Once you've done it, you'll see a message in the center of the window that says link copied. This means that you already have the link on your clipboard. 
and you'll only have to share it with whoever you want. The link will redirect to a Wondershare web viewer where anyone with the shareable link can view the document. Without a doubt, this tool has endless uses and I'm sure it's gonna help you a lot in the future. Thank you for watching this video to the end. Now that you know how to share your files between Mac and PC, and you've learned it all in just a couple of seconds, I know that while you're watching this video, you've realized you can do this between Mac and iPhone as well. In other words, now you can manage your documents on any device wherever you are. Don't forget to take a look at the rest of the content on our channel. I'm sure you'll find many more useful tips in how to manage your documents, such as how to transfer your PDF documents from a computer to your phone, or how to store and sync your documents using Apple Books. Be sure to like this video and subscribe to the channel to not miss any future tips, and I'll see you in the next one.